Time for the Hollywood Hot Seats, brought to you by Carpet One, Coleman Street, Belleville, the one store for your perfect floor. A defense lawyer for Michael Jackson's doctor says the singer was so anguished about his deteriorating finances in his final days that he took desperate actions that caused his own death. The latest revelation going on in Dr. Conrad Murray's trial. Madonna denies her charity is under investigation. Her publicist has released a statement saying neither Madonna nor her Raising Malawi charity is under investigation by the FBI or the IRS. She says recent reports about Raising Malawi are wild and totally false rumors. The break-in at Paris Hilton's home has led to a lawsuit of over $60,000 in borrowed jewelry. An insurer for a jeweler is accusing Paris of not returning the jewelry after police gave it back to her. But her spokesman says the police only return costume jewelry, not the expensive stuff. That's her story, and she's mm-hmm. sticking to it. Grammys are about to get a lot more competitive. The Recording Academy is reducing the number of categories by more than 30. The Academy says male and female vocal categories in fields like pop, R, and country are among those being removed. Men and women will now compete in one overall field. Mariska Hardigay is a mom again. She tells People Magazine she and her husband have adopted an infant girl. They've named their daughter Amaya Josephine. She already has a son who is four. And Tina Fey has some big news to talk about. During a tape of the Oprah Winfrey show yesterday, she revealed she's expecting her second child. She's five months along. And it's been a week for reported shakeups for TV journalists, fresh on the heels of news that Meredith Vieira may not renew her contract at Today once it expires later this year. Reports have surfaced that her co-host, Matt Lauer, will step down from his position at the NBC Morning Show. Lauer has already notified his NBC bosses he plans to leave the show when his contract expires at the end of next year. Mark? No. (sighs) Face for radio. If you're celebrating a birthday today, you share this date with James Garner. He's 83. Oh. And John O's of Hollow Notes is 62. And singer Janice Ian is 60. That's the Hollywood Hot Seat brought to you by Carpet One and Quinny's Greatest Hits, 95.5 Hits FM.